What's going on guys? Real quick, it's uh, Sunday. Pretty crappy day. Uh, we had a stellar Friday and Saturday here at the Frank Sargent Show in Tampa. We were, uh, we brought the Vantage. This is a production prototype. Uh, we're taking it back apart and we're going to use it more for templating. And then we'll start rolling production here real soon. But anyways, you're basically going to see the boat here in just a second. One, two, three. And as you see right there, you can see the Vantage. It's 19 feet, 2 inches long. Max rated to a 150. Has a 40 gallon tank, 36 gallon live well. Draft is from 7.5 to 10, depending on how you build it and how you rig it and what kind of power, but it's honest measurements. Basically, the wrap that you see here was done by Pro Marine, ProMarineUSA.com. They are an aftermarket parts supplier. They went ahead and wrapped this with our vision. Mark and I had this vision of a uh, World War II bomber look. If you look right there, you'll see the kills on the side. Yes, people, that's other boat companies. This boat whipped its ass. It went to battle, came back victorious. And you can see the girls there in the back. And you can see the retro. If you look up close, you can see the rivet look and stuff, the metal. Basically, let's take a walk around the boat. This is a center console model. You see how big the bow is. We're going to take a dip down. And you can see how big those spray rails are. Yes, this boat is dry. It will be the driest in its class. And please look at this boat real carefully because you've seen it here first. Big hatch in the front. You got the staggered rods on the side. It's not the cheap plastic. If that's what you want, we'll put it on there. You can get the anodized aluminum. You have a clean, big front deck. You can see the storage. See the hatch on it. Our unique drainage system. We had all our photographs, all our brochures, and everything in this hatch. And yes, everything was dry throughout the storm. I was happy to see it behind these holes which is very simple lightweight no maintenance issue again another creative first here for East Cape it goes through a channel system then under the floor to a stringer see the backrest the ergonomic seats it will have six rod holders under each side for 12 uh, 12 rods up to 11 feet console it's basically our standard lossman console that we have right there but we added a little swoosh to it to put your electronics on top you can also put your switches wherever you want Eastgate fashion you got your split door right there again staggered rod holders your seat cushions we could do one whole seat cushion that flops over out of the way so when you're fishing it's not there we could bolt the seat cushions on we could do a snap so the seat cushions come off you could do the swivel seat chairs but I'm going to open this up, and again, you can see the drainage system, and you can see how deep under here, and you can see how thick this gasket is. And again, this is the compression latch. You just shut, and as you push down, okay, it compresses the hatch. So again, watch it right here on the corner. Boom. It goes up, goes down, goes up, goes down. And again, if you forget to close your hatch, you'll know. And we have a belly strap. Live well. Thirty-six gallon. That through hole will be flush. We have five different versions that we have available for you. You pick what you want. Again, I'm going to back away here. Now, come around to the back of the boat. Again, another ECC first, courtesy of Orange County Boat Works. Here's our design on the pulling platform. Very sturdy. This is like a floating peg. You can see right through it. Very artsy-fartsy. What we thought, we could put grip tape here on top. 
We can cap it. We do round steps. We could do a traditional four post, as you see. It just basically depends on what you want. Come to the back of the boat. Again, you can see the real running pad. You can see the dead rise in the back, 14 and a half degrees. Again, key to this boat is sponsoring. Well, we'll try to get around. The other thing, get on the forum and, uh, it's a straight across. Yeah, other boats to to come over and boat down boat and across. You then you need extra bilges. Easy to access, all your plumbing right there. Straight shoot for all your wires and your harness and stuff. So, again, see how windy it is right now. It's blowing. guys take it easy thank you very very much it's been a good show crappy today which is not bad it's a nice break and again this boat is absolutely sick and again the wrap on it signifies who we are went to battle came out and won we did our homework and like always, it's an original design. We don't copy, we don't splash. And uh, we do it the East Cape way. You guys take care, God bless. Thank you very much. More to come later, bye.